The Sixers continuing their tough stretch of games, but the San Antonio Spurs come in red hot. You know, Lou Williams at 15 and a half points per game, the only bench player in the NBA to lead his team in scoring. The fans coming out to Philadelphia to see Tim Duncan early on. They'd see Gary Neal getting fouled and putting it in. San Antonio with a 23-17 first quarter advantage. We stay in the first. Danny Green gets rejected by LaVoy Allen. The Sixers off and running. Williams to Drew Holiday spotting up and connecting. Holiday 15.7 dives Philadelphia up by one. Back the other way. More from beyond the line. That's Gary Neal. 12 points in the first quarter. It's 26-24. Now Neal finding Tiago Splitter. He goes in. 32-26 advantage for the road team. Elton Bland back in the lineup. Blocking Tim Duncan. Now it's Thaddeus Young over to Lou Williams. 36-33. Brandon Company within three. Now Duncan finding the red hot Tony Parker. Five point advantage for the road squad. We go to the third quarter. San Antonio led by three. Andre Iguodala trying to make his case to be named an Eastern Conference All-Star Reserve. He goes in for two of his 17, also had seven boards. One point deficit. Now Tony Parker driving. The floater finds the bottom of the cup. Parker, 37 points, eight assists. He was 12 of 24 from the field. Here doing the dishing over to Matt Bonner, 71-59 San Antonio. Now Lou Williams brings it down the court, spots up, and he drills it. 22 for Williams. That gets the Sixers within six. They're certainly hanging around. More from Williams, this time fighting Thaddeus Young, working the two-man game. Baseline jumper, pure, 89-83. But way too much of the San Antonio offense. Parker to Tim Duncan, who had 16 and 11, a 10-point road victory for the San Antonio Spurs, snapping a four-game losing streak at Philadelphia. Overall, it's six straight wins for the Spurs.